her being pregnant and me it just could I couldn't cope that I was having a little brother that was the same age as my children. <laughs> right. You know. But you know, you just go with the flow. Because you had and already it had turned a all good. Oh. Yep. So, yep, Sean, I already had Chantel. Uh -huh. So I was an uncle before oh. I was even born. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that happens. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's crazy. Mm-hmm. Shout out to my niece. Yep. Mm -hmm. Her and her family. Yeah. And daddy was daddy was always always around. I remember well, okay, I remember being in a household with my dad, being a, a young kid. Um, mostly before elementary school. And okay. I remember around kindergarten, you know, when him and mom split up. And then uh I do remember him being around like from just be I was like four years old because I remember just before I went to kindergarten. And then not seeing him till I was probably in the second grade. So, I mean, okay. it wasn't too much time that passed. Mm -hmm. But from that point on, Daddy was always a constant presence nice. in, in our life. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. Well, you know, we didn't really... Well, I guess we did have a lot. We did have a lot of folks. But I'm talking about as far as, like, him and Mama. Right. Was their relationship mm -hmm. always pretty cool after, uh, after he came back? Mm -hmm. After they separated? Oh, my came. goodness. Oh, yeah. yeah. After... Um, the breakup and then a the separate estrangement for a while. I guess you know mm. they both had to go through their own things. Right, right. And uh, ever since uh, my dad came back around, him and mom relationship was was actually really cool. It really was. You um, know, mom was with Jack and he was with uh, I don't know who she was with. He oh, back he then, was, uh, Jack was a Jackie. You remember Jackie? What I don't you remember. Know? What I don't you remember know about Jackie. <laughs> yeah, because I heard and, stories. <laughs> okay, because Jackie, as a matter of fact, I was 15 years old, and I lived with my dad and Jackie, so yeah. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't know my, that. I lived with my dad from the time I came back from Louisiana when I was like 15 years old. I lived with mother and a posse at the house, oh. 10, 10 Casey Street. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Oh. And uh, I stayed with dad uh, for about a year. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so that was an experience, you know. Mm. Had my little part-time job at KFC. Oh, you I remember working? we lived. Uh huh. We lived in uh, Redwood City. I remember going to I think Woodside High out there. In Redwood. But yeah, at that time I was going from high school to high school. I was having some issues, y'all. Oh my mm -hmm. goodness. Mm hmm. Yeah. You being a bad. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, my sister ain't never been bad. I don't know what y'all talking if about. If social media was out <laughs> back then. <laughs> Man, you got in some trouble, huh? I'd have gotten some big or, trouble. Or you'd have went viral. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I definitely probably would have went viral. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Goodness, some talking about some damn shit, Oh my some god, what's going on? <laughs> mm -hmm. But That's um, cool. but me and Dad's always been close. Always, always. Right. Yeah. Did uh -huh. you ever go out like on trips, fishing, or anything with Dad? Or uh, that is one of my fondest memories. Yeah. With dad is uh, our fishing trips. Nice. I remember, and this is around the time I lived with, with him uh, out in Redwood City, him and Jackie. The San Mateo Bridge, y'all. Me and daddy would park by the bridge and we would walk through these open, there was always an opening in the gate. You know, no <laughs> so trespassing. Yeah, y'all wasn't supposed to be there. Yeah, wasn't we weren't supposed there. to be there. <laughs> Y'all thugging. Um, <laughs> yep. And we would fish under the San Mateo Bridge, you guys. Nice. I mean, that is actually one of my fondest memories. Yeah. Under mm -hmm. the bridge with, with Pops just hanging mm -hmm. out. And then all the other fishing trips, too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. A lot of fishing trips. Oh, my God. I remember us being in a little canoe. I don't know if it was Clear Lake or... I know it was a lake and I know it was a little tiny boat. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Scared the bejesus out of me. Yeah, my, my dad was a fisherman. Sure, he he would live off the land. Like that. Sure. Mm-hmm. So yeah, and can't get nobody to go fishing with me. People just don't fish talk like they used to. Not in my yeah. circle, but you know, when it was coming up, I remember with mom and uh, you know, the Jacksons. We would always go on like camping trips and fishing trips and stuff. That was always fun. Nice. Mm -hmm. So you've been on your camping trips. Mm-hmm. Yep. Nice. Yeah, yeah dad used to uh, take me fishing too. I'm mm -hmm. going up. A few times, uh, your son came with us a couple times. Uh huh, uh huh. Um, but I just know, well, not that I noticed, but growing up with a father that's older, yeah, I, I had to be a lot more patient. And uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's uh, I think uh, I, that's I one of the reasons why. Uh, uh huh. 
I guess I'm not. Uh, I wasn't as wild. You was not a wild child right. at all. It was because of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I had to learn how to be patient, um, and not be in a rush to do things. But well, people, you obviously knew how to adjust to your environment. Okay, I gotta turn this phone off. You gotta have me right back. Hold on. My brother, I'm editing this part out. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's D's job. He's the editor. <laughs> I'm going to add it to the bloopers. <laughs> yeah, bloopers. There you go. <laughs> this sauce is bomb. Hold on, now. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, okay. So you say younger, you too? I know. He's eating seafood, huh? Oh, he's eating Molly, mukbang. Molly got her bottle over here. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's doing a mukbang, huh? Mm. <laughs> okay, where were we? Okay. Um. Yeah, but uh. Oh.